We're going to look at a new feature in the desktop connector, which allows us to upload XREF DWG files, and it will also upload all of the linked files as well. So that be the host as well as all the child files. And there are two different ways in which it does it. So you need two sessions of uh, File Explorer opened. And what we're going to do on the left-hand one, we've got our files that we're going to upload in, and there are two different versions. There is my XREF factory, which has all of the linked files in the same as the local as the host file, and my factory XREF host, which has the linked files in separate folders stored on somewhere on the system. And we're going to see how BIM360 Docs treats th these two situations. So we'll start off with the link file. So on the right-hand pane, we're going to go and navigate to the folder itself. So we're going to go into the project, BIM360 environment. So we're going to navigate to the BIM360 environment, to our hub, the project that we want, noticing that it only connects to the project files half of the BIM360 docs environment. And then we can navigate to the folder where we want to transfer these files to. So we select test, and now we're going to drag in the one that has all of the files in the same local folder. And all we need to do is to drag and drop from our File Explorer window into the other File Explorer window, which is connected to our BIM360 docs via the desktop connector. And what happens then, all the files are then transferred can take a little bit of time. We don't know how quick it is. But there they all are. So they are now uploaded. And if we were to go into the BIM360 docs environment itself and navigate to that file that we loaded into, we will see those files being uploaded. We say take a bit of time. And there we have all the files uploaded into the BIM 360 document management environment um, and the particular folder to which we load them into. So that concludes that process. Thank you.